All right, to solve this question, we'll use the following rule. It says if two events are independent, then the probability that both events occur will be equal to the product of each probability. So here we are told that the probability of A and B occurring is equal to 0 0.6. So we'll plug this into our formula. Now, since this probability and this probability must both be less than or equal to 1, we can conclude that each probability must be greater than or equal to 0 0.6. Here's why. Let's consider the possibility that the probability of A occurring is 0 0.3 that would mean that the probability of B occurring would have to be equal to 2. And no probability can be greater than 1. So as you can see here, each probability must be greater than or equal to 0 0.6. So column A is equal to 0 0.6 or greater, which means column A is greater than column B, which means our answer is A.